let me practice this message before I leave. You know, because the mothers like it when you, <laughs> when you preach right. Then when you preach right, they give you some money. I, I know that's right. I know that's right. Okay, let, let me try this last uh, message I did last week. Um, uh, Jesus will work it out. Yeah. <clears throat> mm -hmm. I tried him on a Thursday. Not only did I try him on a Thursday, but I tried him on a Friday. And he's not only a Friday God, but he's a Saturday and Sunday. I wish I had some Spanish saints in the midst that knew what I was saying on a Domingo. Somebody say, yes. You ought to lift your hands and say, yes. Yeah. Okay. Nah, I, I can't do that then. No, I can't do Spanish saints. All right, let's see, let's see. Uh, uh, I'm going to try it my way. I, I'm going to do it my way. Um, uh, I tried him. He's never failed me yet. He's a God that I can trust just when I need him most. He's a mighty good God. Oh, let, let me pull the chair. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes. I love him on a good old Thursday. He's a mighty God. The Bible says if I trust him and lean not to my own understanding, but in all my ways, acknowledge him. Oh my God, like what is he doing? Girl, he's just practicing his sermons. This is what he do all the time. Practicing? Mm -hmm. Reverend? What are you doing? Well, nurse, haven't you heard that? You've got to practice what you preach. Practice what you... I thought y'all had that ghost, that, that holy ghost. Did you hear him? Yeah. You got the holy ghost? That, I thought that's who did that. Sister, let me tell you about the holy ghost. The holy ghost will make you talk right. Mm -hmm. The holy ghost will make you act right. Mm -hmm. And even when you're talking, he'll quicken you every now and then. That's the kind of holy ghost I'm talking about. Oh, well, your holy ghost is scaring me. Look, look, just call me a thing anymore, all right? Bye, Robert. All right, Sister Nurse. I tell you, Clara, where do you find these people? Lord, have mercy. Clara, what, what brings you here today? James, I've been laying down for seven months. Plus, you know me. I like to be outdoors, feeling the cool breeze with my shades on in the sun. You know how we used to do when we used to hold hands, walk through the park together. You. Clara, that was a long time ago. James, we need to talk. I'm tired. I'm scared. And I'm about to leave here. But before I go, James, I need to know if God has forgiven me for what I've done. I need to know if he's forgiven us for what we've done. Please tell me God has forgiven us, James. I can't go not know. Clary, God has forgiven us. That was a long time ago. James, I'm sick. And this thing is killing me. It's time for us to tell him. I cannot leave here, James, and knowing that our son is going to continue to live this lie like we have. James, you have to promise me. <coughs> James, you have to promise me that you'll tell him. <coughs> Don't let him live this lie like we have, James. <coughs> James, please promise me you'll tell him. <coughs> promise me, James. Clara. <coughs> Nurse. <coughs> Nurse. Promise me, James, you'll tell him. <coughs> please. James, please promise me you'll tell him. <coughs> I'm going to be all right. I can't keep this secret, James. Please. <coughs> Promise me, James, please. Oh, James, please promise me. Oh. 
Clara. I promise. Right. You sure that's not James' suit? What you dressed 
boy, you, you, dre- you look like you're about 45 years old, but you're dressed. Right? <laughs> That's not funny. Wait, but listen, before you get comfortable, I need you to go to the store. I need you to go get some hot sauce. Yes. Right now? Hot sauce. Do you want my fried chicken? I'll go get some hot sauce. I'll go get the hot sauce. I'll be right back. <laughs> why you gonna get that? Uh, you know, just a random thought. But why you gonna get the hot sauce? Just because you look like the pastor, don't mean you are the pastor. So don't try to go pray for people or nothing because, you know, you might get beat up. You're just about a few inches tall. So I don't Shut do up. That. You know what? You know what you can do? You can go to the beautician who did your hair, and you can go take them strings that they attach this thing to, and you tell her to go hang herself. That's what you, that's what you need to go do. You crazy yeah, so. I'll be back, Mama Ray. I'll be back. Angela!
don't like the way you just called her name. Say it over. <laughs> Say it like you got some respect this time. Mm -hmm. First lady, here are some ordination papers for you Sunday at You know, first lady, I had some ordination papers for you Sunday. <laughs> but when you get a chance, if you can just look it over for She's going to look them over as soon as... Me and my dogs look them over. Because y'all little kids, y'all don't wash your head. You'll be on Facebook and Twitter and all that other kind of stuff. They don't tell her what's in here. She probably can't read it because everything probably abbreviated. Look at this, LOL. Wow. Um, you know, First Lady, I honestly, seriously, every day, I don't know how you can put up with these crazy women Cra around you. Crazy? Crazy? Girl, you're about to make me hot. <laughs> Did you just call me crazy? Let me explain something to you, you little vixen. Coming up in here with this bun. Acting like don't nobody know what y'all church girls do with these buns in your hair. Mm. What? These buns are cover-ups. Mm. Cover-up? Yeah, the church holds where the buns. <laughs> nothing else because if you say something else I'm gonna sick them on you. Mm. I'm gonna sick my dogs on you. You First see lady, right there? I, then I said I'm still talking. Mm. Don't you interrupt me again. I'm a ooh, girl I'm gonna slap you so hard. <laughs> you see her right there? Let me introduce you to my dogs. That right there is Sue. And Sue ain't scared of shit. Hey hey hey. Ooh. I'm not. And that right there that right there is Tarex Cutter. George! <laughs> you know why we call it Tarex Cutter? Because we don't know when she going to mess around and cut somebody. Mm -hmm. You want her to try something on you? Say something else. I see, I can tell that you're trying to think of something to say. Say something else. First lady, I'll have to see you Wednesday, Sunday. Sunday, yes. What about Tuesday? Prayer and Bible study. How about that? How about Wednesday? Great.
Your mom died. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. She's gone. My mother died and I wasn't even there. You was out buying hot sauce. <laughs> You know what? Thank you, Pastor. I just want to I just want to tell you thank you, man. You know cuz right now I probably would act different if you didn't teach me the things you taught me. Yes. I thank you for being here for her. You and Mama Ray, I appreciate y'all, man. For real. And you've been like a father to me. You did say you did say to be absent from the body. Is to be present with the Lord. Oh, That's what you said, Pastor. That's what you told me. So I know, I know she in a better place. Hopefully. And I'm just glad I'm able to deal with it better. You know, Pastor, I love you, man. I appreciate you for real. For real. Thank you so much, man. Well, I think, I think I'm going to call Sister Frida. Uh, she's really good with making funeral arrangements. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Please sit down. What's the matter, Jay? I have something else to tell you. Anton. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I was calling. Please put the phone down. I have something to say. What is it, James? Great, no matter what. I, I, I love you. Oh, no. I love my family. No. What's going on? Great. Anton is my son. What?
everybody, just calm down. Please calm down. I know that this is hard on everyone in this room, but the past is the past. And right now, this boy done lost his mother. And this is just a little bit too much for him to take all at once. Antoine, come here, son. Come here. <laughs> Come to me, son. I want you to hear what I'm saying to you. Your mother did a good job raising you. She was good to this church. She was good to me. And obviously, she was good to your father. <laughs> And we're gonna work this out, son. We will work this out. You have to be kidding me. I promise you. Trust me. We're gonna work this out. I just don't like the way she acting right now. She ain't acting like no black woman, that's for sure. <laughs> James, go inside and change your clothes. We'll talk about this later, babe. We'll talk about this later. Wait, so you supposed to be like my brother? Not your brother. I don't know.